We are Hugh and Crystal Reed, and this is our story. Um, we've been married for 15 years, and for the first 13 years, um, it was hard. About two years ago, I had an affair, and then had another affair. And after the first affair, I was ready to leave my family, so I packed up my things after a business trip and left the house. For some reason, I came back the next day. I, I couldn't go through with it. But I didn't feel guilt about what I'd done. I felt guilt about the pain I'd caused around me. I didn't feel true conviction for my sin, basically. After the second affair was over, I talked with Crystal, and we prayed deep into the night about it, and I accepted Christ as my Savior. And ever since then, I felt the Holy Spirit and His conviction in my life, and that's changed the whole dynamic of our marriage. I was immediately told by God, I want you to stay. Even though I told Hugh after the first affair, I am not going to stay in a marriage with you if you have if you do this again, if you have another affair. But in that moment, when Hugh was showing that he felt true conviction by the Holy Spirit to confess something to me that I didn't know and probably would never have known, I was very certain that the Lord was telling me to stay in this marriage and that He would heal it. I see Hugh reading God's Word. I see Hugh talking it with our children. I see him living it out every day. I see him doing it at work. You know, he comes home with stories about ways he's sharing his faith at work and will share his testimony with people as needed. And, and that's not the old Hugh. Our marriage is harder than it's ever been, but it's stronger and it's better than it's ever been. But I think it will be hard the rest of our lives. I think, you know, there has been doubt planted there, you know, maybe forever, and Satan will look for opportunities to really play on that doubt. So it is up to us to consistently and daily um, look to the Lord, and that is the only way we can get through every day because it has been really hard. I thought church was more about feeling like you had it all together and that you're headed in the right direction uh, and not so much, how do we get there? But now, since I've become a Christian, I've learned that um, we are broken. You know, there are no perfect people in the church, and that's been awesome to have that support of people. Once we've told them our story, it's, it hasn't been judgment. It's been support. It's been, what can we do? You know, oh, I understand how you're feeling about that. I think for people who have a spouse who may not be a Christian or is, is far away from God, um, there is hope, you know, he, he does speak to people over time. So um, I, I hope that Crystal sees now after the fact that she, she did play that huge role in me coming to faith. This is all about the miracle that God performed in Hugh, in our marriage, in our family, with our children. It's all about him. It's about his love for us, the way he pursued Hugh his entire life, the way he continues to pursue me in deep hurt and anger and countless other emotions. Um, it's a constant pursuit that we see every single day, and that's what the story is all about. Again, we're Hugh and Crystal Reed, and God is turning our marriage into something beautiful. <laughs>